Think if you took a relational database, a data warehouse, data science workloads, um, applications that can live in there, a data marketplace, data sharing, put them all together and now you get a data platform. I think what makes it so unique is this is the first tool that was actually built for the cloud to be used in the cloud. But what if we could really embrace the cloud for all the great stuff that's in there? And that's what Snowflake has done. And they've taken it where they put all of these different workloads combined into a single area. So I don't need to go out and buy 30 different tools to work with it. You know, you got your large enterprise clients that has petabytes worth of data. And you have kind of your startups that, you know, that are getting, they're starting to do it. They have a, they have a very limited budget, but they need to get data. The great part is, is Snowflake between their pricing model and how their scalability, it works for both. I've had clients that had trillions of rows with a T in a singleized table. So the largest in the, in, the, in the world. If you go look at Snowflake's client list and you look at the names, I mean, these are Fortune 10 companies that are utilizing Snowflake for all of their data. But then on the other side of it, you have these startups, you have these small companies that maybe only needs, you know, 100 gigs, not a lot but they need somewhere that they can do it. They need the horsepower. They don't have the budget to go hire a team of 50 to, to support this. They just have this one guy that's wearing multiple hats. It's a great use case over there. And obviously the people in the middle.